welcome back to another video. I hope you're all doing okay. You'll notice I am in a completely different background. Um, I'm doing a bit of a different video today, as you will be able to tell from the title. I'm going to do like a little bit of a day in the life, week in the life kind of thing. Um, obviously, we started Nobu. It officially launched in November, well, 31st of October. Um, and I did like a little introductory video about Nobu, but I haven't really done much else. Um, obviously my channel is mainly for like nail techs and stuff, but I thought I would kind of branch out and do a little bit of a video, or if you guys like these videos, I can do more um, of kind of like the day in the life of a small business. Obviously, like I say, Nobu set up on 31st of October and it is kind of like a salon supplies business. So obviously it is me and my cousin that do Nobu. She is a hairdresser and we basically brought the um, nail side and the hair side and brought it together and nobody was born so yeah I'm at the unit now um, I have basically come I need to uh, pack a few orders so I thought I would bring you guys with me so that you can see um, a little bit behind the scenes obviously like I say I have done a, a bit of an introductory video and showing you guys um, the products that we do and stuff um, but I still get messages from people saying that they didn't even know that I do know boo. They don't even, they didn't even know that like, I sold like, um, you know, nail products and stuff. So I thought I would do a bit of a day in the life, give you a bit of behind the scenes, pack some orders and um, just kind of show you what we get up to. And yeah, so we will crack on. Um, I will get some of the orders packed and I will show you a bit of behind the scenes um, in the unit as well. So this is our little packing table. Um, you will see it just, it's not very like <laughs> aesthetically pleasing, but down there is just our shredded tissue paper. Um, that is just some boxes that get to go with the cones, which is one of our products. Um, we just have some spare like ribbon and old cards down there, tissue paper and the mailing bags. And on here is just where I basically um, pack the orders on this little table. Now I did actually do a separate video about this um, um, sticky back plastic. So we basically got this sticky back plastic from B&M and we use this a lot of the time for background of pictures. Um, I've literally just like rolled it on here because I was doing a TikTok video of a packing video and I just wanted to make it a look, look a little bit more pretty. Um, so yeah, I use this uh, roller sticky back plastic. Normally what I do is I just get some boxes at the back and then kind of rest it up on top of it. Um, I'll put a little screenshot in the corner of how the pictures come out. Um, but yeah, they're great when I'm doing like um, packing videos or like just doing a video of like a new product or whatever. Um, so yeah, that is our little packing table. And then behind me here, we have the shelves. This is just like a little shelving unit with all of our products on it. Um, so we have obviously all the individual glitters there, have our filing kits, um, the um, five pack of glitters there, bagged up and ready to go. We have all of the files up here um, with the setting clips as well, the e-files up there, just kind, of, just kind of like some extra stock and packaging and stuff. Um, and then all of our brushes and stuff are down there and the buffing blocks. So yeah, this is just where we keep all of our products behind us. And then obviously here is where we pack all of the orders. So yeah, that is um, basically our packing area. I would just go ahead and obviously start packing um, a few orders that we've got now. So I've got them here in front of me. Obviously I won't show you guys like any names or information or anything um but the um first order that we've got is for a christmas bundle i'm sure yeah so we have a christmas bundle um, which includes a filing kit and any two glitters so the first thing i'll do is i'll just make up one of our small boxes uh, we get our boxes from kite packaging um, they all come flat packs, so we just build them as and when we need them, just to save some space in the unit. Um, so I'll just build that up first. There we go. And then I'll grab uh, some tissue paper, which was just underneath. So I just forgot to um, place the ribbon in first. <laughs> I always forget to do that. And then I'll just put a little bit of um, shredded tissue paper in. 
And then obviously, so this um, order was for a Christmas bundle, which is one of our filing kits. So like I say, these were all already bagged up, um, but I'll just show you what's inside. So we have one of each file. So we have the 100, 100, the 180, 240, and the 180, 180. So you just get one of each in the filing kit and then one of our buffers as well, which I will show you now. One of our buffing blocks. Um, so that is our complete filing kit. And then she has ordered the two glitters of her choice were Peacock and Barbie doll. So I'll just pop the filing kit in there. And then I'll just get a separate bag and grab two, two of the glitters from behind me. So obviously this one is a Barbie doll and this one is Peacock. Um, and I'll just pop those in that bag there. Seal that up and pop that in there. So that is this order done. So I'll just fold over the tissue paper grab a odd card from the um, drawers behind me so there's a little odd card that we pop in as well and then we'll just seal um, the package with our ribbon there we go so that one is all done that is Lauren's order And then what I'll do is we just pop a sticker on the top of the box as well. So I'll just finish that off with one of our stickers to go on top of the box. And then we have the um, packing tape as well to go on. So here's our packing tape, which says love with love from Nobu. It's literally the cutest thing ever. Um, so I'll just cut some of that off and seal the box. So there we go, that is all finished. I'll just pop that in a small mailing bag. And there we go, that is the first order done. Um, and we will just go on to the next one. I'll label that up a little bit later. So the next one that I need to do, I'm pretty sure the rest are just for e-files now. Um, all right, yeah. So this next one is for the nail tech starter kit. So we actually have starter kits on the website as well, which include one of our e-files, all five of the nail art glitters and the filing kit. So I'll just pack one of those up next. I just need to grab a big box. Here's one I made earlier. <laughs> um, right, so here is a big box that we need to, we basically have to um, use these when we are packing the e-files because there is, they are quite a big box. Let me, there we go. Right, so um, obviously we'll start by cutting the ribbon and we're just laying that in the bottom of the box. So when you order one of the starter kits, you obviously have the option of what color e-file you want. So there is pink, baby blue, and gray. So in this order, it is the gray one, which looks a little bit like that one. And I'll just uh, make sure everything's in the box, including the user manual and everything. Um, so I'll just get that packed up now. And pop the uh, e-file in one of our box sleeves. So there we go, that is the um, e-file all done. So I'll just pop that in. And then like I mentioned in the starter kits, you do get the, uh, the five uh, nail art glitters as well, which are all bagged up here, ready to go. Um, so you've got uh, dragonflies, fairy tales, Barbie doll, grape soda, and peacock all in there. 
So I'll just pop that in the box as well. And then we also have the filing kit, which is what I showed you a little bit earlier. So I'll just pop that in. Right, so that is our bigger box done. So we have got the larger mailing bags. So I'll just pop it in there now. Right, so there it is packed up and we'll just pop one of our little fragile stickers on it as well. And that will go and be labeled up now. So this next order for Charlotte, she's ordered the bluey file. So I just thought I'd give you a little bit of a look of what that one looks like before I pack it. Um, so I'll just get the pan piece put in there and obviously the user manual and put that in one of our box sleeves. There we go. So that one is ready. I'll just get um, all the tissue paper and stuff put in there. So that's the last one done. Um, I'm just gonna now head over to the desk and I'm gonna do all of the labels.
So there we go, that's those orders all labelled up now and I'm just gonna take those to the post office. Hello guys, so we dropped those off at the post office. There was a little bit of a change of plan. We've now decided to come to um, just grab a coffee and do some um, editing. Obviously, I needed to edit, edit this YouTube video, um, but there was a few other bits that I could do for Nobu as well. Um, obviously, we have um, everything online, everything to our website is online, so um, pretty much I can do anything from anywhere. So um, obviously we can come here, we can do a few bits for Instagram. We've had quite a few um, questions on our TikTok recently. Um, if there is one thing that I can suggest for a small business, is to make sure you're literally active on all like social medias. Um, we literally, I posted a video yesterday um, on one of our TikToks and we've had so many questions off the back of it. Um, and it literally, it can help small businesses so much. So I would literally majorly recommend um, Instagram, TikTok, all that sort of stuff for small businesses. Cause it literally creates so many opportunities and it does, it's literally helps us in so many ways. Um, so yeah, we had a lot of questions from our TikTok video yesterday um, that I've basically been going, you know, back into from people, uh, you know, just answering any questions. Um, so yeah, it, it, I mean, I suppose there's pros and cons because it literally never stops. I think because it's on your phone and on your laptop, you'd never kind of switch off from it. So yeah, it's a massive help for us, um, especially obviously because we are like a new startup business. Obviously getting our name out there is like really important. So. Um, yeah, I've been doing a lot of that um, in the last few hours. Um, we've come and sit down and I've edited this YouTube video. Obviously, I know this is the first YouTube video that I've done for Nobu. Um, well, second actually, because I did the introductory video. Um, but obviously, this was just kind of like a kind of like a first one i'm not really too sure if you guys will be interested or if you would like to see these kind of videos so make sure you let me know um obviously if you want me to do more of these videos than i can do and obviously if you prefer me to kind of stay focused in one point then obviously i can do and um, most of this video was obviously me packing orders and stuff um and obviously we do a lot on like social media and things like that so if there is anything, you know, any particular topics that you guys want help with or would like me to do like a specific video on, then just let me know. Um, but yeah, like obviously, like I say, um, I'm editing for YouTube now. Obviously there was a, a few kind of bits that I needed to do on the website and, and just kind of keep, keep an eye on any, any inquiries and stuff like that. But like I say, um, I won't go too in depth. I'll keep this video not too long and boring. Um, and you guys can let me know what you enjoy seeing and what you don't enjoy seeing and what you want maybe for me to go into more detail with. Um, so yeah, that is what I'm gonna be doing for um, the next few hours. Uh, and then I will catch up with you a bit later. Hello guys, so we are probably, I don't know how many days since I last filmed, I think it either one or two, um, but I did actually try and do a little bit of a clip yesterday, but basically the only thing is, is like I literally yesterday I went to the warehouse and packed another few orders, but literally so many of them have been for the same thing, like we've been getting loads of orders for the e-files, so a lot of it is kind of the same thing, like just me going to the warehouse, packing the orders for the same things. So um, obviously I don't want to make this video too repetitive. Um, but yeah, I just kind of wanted to drop in. Obviously we've done another day at the warehouse today. Well, oh my God, I've not, I've not got my watch on today. What time is it? It's midday, 10 to one. Um, so we've done the morning at the warehouse. We were actually up very early this morning. Oh, Cleo making an appearance and um, yeah, so we were up very early this morning. Um, well, I say very early. It wasn't that early, but still. Um, yeah, we were up early and being productive. So we've been to the warehouse already, packed some orders again for all for e-files. So um, yeah, nothing new to show really. Um, and we've just got to the post office and it was closed. So um, yeah, but I think today's a bank holiday. So we kind of should have looked at that a little bit earlier. Um, but yeah, so and today is monday so i don't know whether you guys whether i've told you guys that monday is a specific nobu day so we have 
<laughs> Sammy with Hi, me on a Monday. Guys. We have Sammy on a Monday. Um, so obviously Nobu is me and Sammy. Um, obviously this is my cousin. So we run Nobu together, um, but we're only together properly doing Nobu stuff on a Monday, which is really sad because she still works full time. She won't soon. But um, yeah, so it's a little bit easier for me to do stuff here and there. But on a Monday, we are blessed with the both of us. And um, yeah, we can kind of proper knuckle down and get what we need to do, get what we need done, done. Um, so yeah, we are, like I say, halfway through the day. We've just been doing a few boring bits this morning online to the bank and stuff. And then, like I say, packed some orders, got to the post office. It is now closed. So we're going to get some food. We're going to get some lunch and then probably go back to the warehouse and do a few more boring bits, to be honest. Um, but like I say, I don't want to kind of go too much into detail in this video because um, I don't really know what you guys like to see or what you don't like to see because obviously I've not done a video like this yet. Um, this will be my first one that I've done like a day in the life of a small business owner kind of thing. Um, so you guys will have to let me know what you like seeing, what you don't like seeing. And then if you want us to go kind of more in depth in a certain topic, then we can do. Um, but yeah, other than that, I feel like I'm doing all the waffling and I've not let you speak. <laughs> <laughs> but she's not used to doing youtube and tiktok and all that sort of stuff so um so yeah we need to get need to get her used to it first she's this is her first like import into youtube i've just got my um air freshener hanging in the way there um but yeah so i will probably leave it here um and wrap the video up and like i say you guys can let me know what you want to see more of or if you prefer to just kind of want me to stick to my nail content than I can do um but yeah we just thought we would give you a bit of an insight into what we get up to what our days consist of and all that sort of stuff so um other than that yeah thank you so much for watching please remember to like and subscribe and if you want to give Nobu a follow I'll put their little app down here um as well as their website so make sure, sure you go and have a look and uh, see what we've got going on there because we will have some january sales coming on as well um so yeah have a lovely day thank you so much for watching and um yeah i'll see you guys soon see you in the next video bye bye